up, it's your boy D Black. We back with another tutorial on how to play college football playoffs and NCAA 14 revamp. I'm gonna make this tutorial quick and easy and fast because it's easy steps. Uh, <coughs> I'm gonna link the GitHub down in the description what you need to download. So once you get to this page, scroll over here. You can read this if you want. And you download NCAA 14 Dynasty tool. 2.1.0 zip. I don't need it because I already have it. I'm gonna minimize that. So, uh, the first thing you need to do is when you're in NCAA 14, this isn't my record. All I did was speed run through these. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna advance the week to the uh, conference championship. And so, after I advance to the conference championship, what you'll need to do is, is open a folder. Well, not yet. You'll need to save this first before you open the folder. So give this a second to load. It will take a minute. Like I said, this isn't my record, so don't go in the comment section saying, oh, D went five and six, or six and six, or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But I just sped run through this just to show you how to get playoffs and NCAA 14 revamp. So it's loading, give it a second. So okay, here's on the conference championship. So what I'm gonna do is, once this finish, probably won't even get in a bowl game. So once this is finished, scroll over to, let's see, save dynasty. I'm gonna do new. Let's put D. Done. Yes, I want to save. So I'm gonna go back. I'm not even gonna close it out. I'm just go back to the home screen. Minimize this. I'm gonna go into my NCAA 14 Dynasty tool. So you see, I have a test Dynasty, Dynasty thing or whatever. I can really go into that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the College Football Playoff section. I'll do 12 team playoffs. Step one: This is setting the bracket. All 12 playoff bids are awarded as a at-large bid to the top 12 teams in the college football poll. The top four seeds receiving a bye weekend. Matchups are set to number 5 versus number 12, number 6 versus number 11, and number 7 versus number 10, number 8 versus number 9, with the high seed hosting teams in both locations are fully customizable. So, like, you could actually do custom logos and this, that, and the third, but like I said, we're just going to do the playoffs. So, step one, what you need to do is click this. You're gonna open your dynasty file. I'm gonna show you how to get to it. So if like I said if you have RPCS3, you'll go into RPCS3. Dev underscore HPV0. You go into home 001 or whatever that is. You have to save data. And then you find where your dynasty is. Mine is dynasty D that I just say. And then you use USR dash data. You'll open it. And it'll show you all the teams in the college football playoffs. So as you see, USC is number one, Clemson's number two, Ohio State's number three, Boise State's number four. So what uh, what you can do is you can look at all the other teams: Oklahoma, Kansas State, Washington, Ole Miss, Florida, Florida State, Arkansas, Michigan. It's kind of surprising Bama is in there. But then after this is set up like this. You can't change it around, of course. But when you get to the bowl game, okay, let me check this. When you get to the bowl games, you can edit these and put them as whatever you would like. So, like, Washington versus Hawaii, you can edit that. You can have a different team play them, or a top 25 team or whatever. As you see, Georgia, I don't, <laughs> excuse me, I don't think Georgia's even in there, like I said. Oh, yes they are. Six and six. Notre Dame. <laughs> Armed Forces Bowl. That's hilarious. But uh, Alabama's in the uh, Cheez It. No, Autos on Liberty Bowl. Okay. But like I said, you can edit some of these if you want. And what you would do is after you edit them, you save it. Dynasty has been saved. Please head back to the game and load your dynasty to continue. I'm going to close this. Minimize this. I'm going to head back into my dynasty. And load it. And I'm 
advanced week to my bowl season. As you saw, it said I'll be playing Notre Dame. In the Armed Forces Bowl, which is cool. Give it a second to load up. And you can go into the ESPN thing to see who's playing who. See, as you see, from six and six, and then uh, Notre Dame is seven and five. So I'll be playing them in the bowl game. You can go into the top twenty-five, or I thought it was a sec oh there it is section for bowl games to see all the bowl games. Like I said, let's find the Alabama. And I forgot who they were playing against. Uh, Oklahoma State, as you see, Liberty Bowl. And that's all to it. And once you win your uh, bowl game, boom, you're good. So, for instance, say if you won your, um, let's go back to the college football playoff. Let's go back to 12 team. Let's do that again. For instance, if you won your uh, college football playoff game, what you would do is, after you won, you go to step two and you open your dynasty file. It's the same process as I done. You go, you play your game, let's go back. You go into your dynasty, you play your game, you save it. After you save it, you open the NCAA uh, bowl mod open. You open your dynasty file, show you how to get to it again. RPCS3, dev on scratch is zero, home, zero, save data, and then you find your save dynasty which is my dynasty and I'll open that up and it'll show the teams that are going to the next round but that's it that's everything so if you need any help add me on discord D black tiktok's D black everything's D black just reach out to me if you need any help with downloading NCAA 14 on PC I would post a video but YouTube always takes it down but it's your boy D black we heading up out of here